How'd you manage to get Eli in your arm anyway? Uh, I was trying to figure out if the water was clean. Got my answer. <laughs> Do you really believe in all that stuff you said about the cataclysms, <laughs> the apocalypse? We can get through here. <sighs> Give me a hand. Be Kwak Yaku. We have to get down there. You sure this is a path? Come on, stay close to me. This is definitely not a path. <sighs> oh. Oh. God. Almost there. Almost there. Heard that before. <sighs> Oh, gotcha. You're right. I'm okay. Just a couple more steps. Okay. Okay. You're all right. I, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. What do you think built all this? It could have been the Inca. They knew a lot about hydraulics. Bridges down. Maybe we can lift it with those counterweights. Maybe. The this depicts the Incan god Kong. He was the son of Inti, the sun god, and Pachamama, the moon goddess. Kong was in charge of the wind and the rain. Although, in some legends, he was only in charge of the weather that came from the south while his brother, Pachacamac, was in charge of weather that came from the north. Me too. Understand. It's almost like <laughs> you want to try it. Uh, I think I'll stick to the bottle in front and the cargo from the plane. You know, if I had known how much time I'd spend in the wilderness, I'd, I'd have paid more attention in Boy Scouts. Wasn't your thing? Well, my family situation meant we didn't get to do a lot of stuff like that. The canopa serves as a receptacle for offerings of cocoa and animal tallow. The stuffed canopa is thrown into the farmer's field at the start of the harvest season as a gift for Pachamama, the mother god. It is said if the present is accepted, the farmer will yield large crops in a successful breeding season. <laughs> Hmm, does boarding school count? <laughs> I don't know. Does it? <laughs> Probably not. But Roth showed me some things. I always prefer the company of adults anyway. Yeah. I'll miss that guy. <sighs> me too. Hey, that did something. I think the water powers the bridge somehow. With Eli gone, your arm should heal quickly. Yeah. I feel a lot better already. It's too heavy. Give me a hand. The water's full of blood. Good. Let's see what those counterweights do. Oh, the 
buckets leaking. Okay, Jonah, you can let go. <laughs> Guess we go through here. After you. some sort of stealer or help me with this sure what is it it's a recipe seems to be a mixture of herbs it could help if we run into any more jaguars <laughs> let's hope we don't we out is over here We're getting closer to the village. I can't wait to get back to civilization. <clears throat> Is 
These are different from the ruins of Mexico. Do you guys know books say anything about Peru? No. I mean, there is supposed to be a secret city of gold in Peru. Paititi. Every treasure hunter on Earth is looking for it. But Dad's notes stop in Mexico. Like he lost interest, or... Or? I don't know. The next volume picks up in Syria. The passageway. That's promising. Remind me how the riddle goes again. Chase the heart of the serpent. To the silver-crowned mountain where the twins confer. Hmm. These two gods are the rulers of the Maya underworld, Shabalba, literally the place of fright. Vukub Kakwish, whose name means Seven Makul, was a monstrous bird who was said to carry the false sun in his beak. His subordinate was Hun Kame, which means one death. They are both defeated and killed by the hero twins after challenging them to various sports and games in which both sides cheated. Vukub Kakwish lost his game of darts when the hero twins used blowpipes. I think we can get out that way. Jonah, help me with this. On three, two, one. Oh, my God. 
Are you okay? Help me with it. Your back looks bad. I'm gonna go make camp. Let me take a look at that. It's not pretty. <laughs> you know, with everything we've been through recently, I've been thinking about my brother. I always try to protect him from my father, from himself. But I lost him. You did everything you could. If I had been in the right place, at the right time, he would still be here. If I had eyes in the back of my head. You can't protect everyone. Thank you. I miss him. I know. My parents. I miss them too. I had a dream about my mother recently. Yeah? Mm-hmm. was so vivid. <laughs> when I was little, my father used to keep things from me. Hide things. About her, especially. Why would he do that? After she died, he thought they'd cause me pain. It didn't stop me from looking for them, of course. <laughs> I still have so many questions. Your dad created as many mysteries as he solved? Dominguez said that he would use the silver box of his shell to remake the world. If you had that power, what would you do? <laughs> Panic, probably. You wouldn't go back to when your brother was alive and be with him again. Um, I lose everything else. No way. I like this world. It's not perfect, but everything I love now is in it. 